Final Fantasy X is life. Now we're getting to the game. Let me edit this real quick. KJ versus Inchbish? Yeah. Ooh, Spocky. Such a Spocky match. Okay, so Sonic vs. Lomac is a very intricate matchup. Sonic? Pretty much, if Sonic wanted to, you could play really lame at a ledge. Get a percent lead like he has right now, just sit at the ledge, wait for Lomac to approach him, and then back throw him, and then back air him to oblivion. That's really all you have to do. Forward air. Ooh. Ooh, that was actually pretty slick. I'm pretty sure KJ fought Solon some friendlies earlier, so yeah. I'm it's, sure he knows what to do. It's definitely a winning matchup for Sonic, but a lot of Sonics tend to think that this is just like a, oh, I don't have to worry. Oh, that's it. That was a good catch. Yeah, he, I think he should have well, upbeat through the spring. Yeah, I, I think the interface didn't catch that the spring was falling on him. Because, like, he, his reaction, there was no reaction to it. He just kind of, like, fell and then got mopped by it, and then air dodge up for like, even if he didn't air dodge he was gone. Little Mac can make it from that eye. But a lot, a lot of Sonics tend to think that this is a blowout matchup, and it really isn't. Like, if Little Mac boxes you out, like, keeps you right out of his range, uh, he can give some Sonic some trouble. But uh, that early kill is going to really put an intuition behind. He's going to have to find a way to take out Sonic, catch him, and uh, take, his, take him out as soon as possible. Uh, right now, Little Mac won't be able to really take him out until... Probably not until like 70, 80 percent near the ledge. And it's, if KJ doesn't want to get hit, he can avoid it. Who else close? I think he slightly through it. Oh boy! I think he should have charged a smash right there. So maybe. Okay. Ninjbush has. Oh, that's dead. Yeah. It's so it's hard. Bad. Like once Ninja, once like it's not even just like it's definitely Little Mac being off stage and having no options. But like Sonic's back air straight up just deletes Little Mac. It's so sad. Like if that back air didn't exist as it as it is right now, then just fish would or Little Mac wouldn't have trouble with it. But I mean, it does exist. Is it because of the Smash Four like delay on the back air? Or well, no, the Brawl back air would still do the same thing. It would do the same thing because the thing is the delay is almost exactly the same. It's just the animation is different, but the delay is still the same. Brawl had the same like they lay hit hits. You just <laughs> that was a good catch. That was nice. Yeah. I think he tried back air. Yeah, he did. It just said it in it Brawl the late hit didn't kill like it does in this game. Oh, yeah, but like definitely. yeah, but kill like, power is significantly <laughs> it's, it's hilarious. You just when he boot people with the back hit and they die, it's just it's funny. Awesome. You definitely feel like a thief when that happens. Um but no like it's not even like how hard it hits, it's just the way it hits him. It hits him into another one and then if he air dodges at all after the back air, he's dead. But like sometimes you have to air dodge because Sometimes the, the Sonic's gonna immediately throw another one out. Four, four, eight. Yeah, so it's like, do I jump or do I air dodge to to die? Or look just at, the raw like, side beat. Look at like that. Back that, air that, kill that whole, the that whole the, the last three hits KJ landed on him were back airs. Like the, that move just makes this matchup so hard. Yeah. But that's when that's when Ninja Fish needs to get that early lead. He needs to get that percentage lead to force KJ to approach him, so he doesn't have to be the one running at Sonic. How are the interactions with spin dashes and? If, if Little Mac holds armor. A, well, oh, armor, um, Little Mac will armor through it, but if Sonic spin dashes fast enough, he actually uh, avoids the hit. Oh, okay. Like, so the multi hits won't do as much damage. Yeah, well, the multi hits will still hit Little Mac, and but the thing is, Little Mac's attack will just completely whip. It's just that he won't go into hit stun. Yeah, the, the only way you, you, that, that, the only move that, that doesn't happen with is Little Max up smash, I think, or down smash if you're fast enough. I was but gonna I say down smash, I imagine down, it depends because you gotta hit with like the, the outside of his glove during the super armor because if you hit with the inside, he might still be able to outrun the back hit with the spin. It's really funny because like you'll see him hit it hitting the middle of Little Max's body while the first hit comes out, and then he'll just roll past the back hit because he's so fast on the spin dash. But if there's a slow spin dash, then yeah, he'll get hit by that. So like down smash and up smash would be better for that situation, but it just you know it's it's hard to time that. It really is, especially with it's with a multi hit like Sonic. Yeah. So if the super armor ends early and he's still in your face, he's gonna hit you. This matchup is significantly worse, I, I think though, honestly. I, think, I feel like yeah, Zolo. I, I think it's worse too, but I mean he's doing a good job he right now. Feel comfortable with Max Sonic, so I don't blame him if he wants to try a different character. But I don't know if Zelda's the choice. Well, Zelda's a, a heavy keyboy character, and Sonic and like to put it into perspective, Robin does Zelda's job. Way better. Yeah, I was gonna say Robin. I yeah, uh, and, but, then, but then like Sonic gives Robin a ton of trouble too. So like, so, it's, like both so are what? Like, it's gonna be. I don't know. Fixed. At the same time though, it, the one thing that's nice about Zelda Sonic is that you, uh, unlike the Mac matchup, you don't have to worry about back air just completely deleting your your options. So uh, he's got that going for him. It's just gonna be really hard to just keep While Sonic Robin boxed is, out. Like, back air is a problem, but B becomes a problem. Yeah. 
One thing that, and then the, the other hard part is that Zelda film moves are all really projected. Like, you know what Elevator. she wants. You know what she wants whenever she's, like, in a certain position. It's just, it's hard. It really is. Ooh, caught him with the recovery. That was close. That was so close. Oh. Ooh, both it up there. And uh, Nehru's love is really good against Sonic too, but like, oh no, oh he he went for a uh, well that worked anyway. Um, Nehru's love will give Sonic some trouble too, but if if he doesn't get get caught with a hit stun, he's gonna hit you for like 20 damage every time. So oh, yeah. it's like it's just it's just hard. I'm surprised he went th he opted for Zelda, but hey, at least their own. Also, I. Oh, did do that? Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what that was. Matt, playing this season. Look at you. 2.2k hours. <laughs> like, I was serious when I said, like, he doesn't play any other games. Oh, that's Matt? Yeah, that's Matt. Terry Gator. Sweet Mother of Mercy power. I didn't know those were that did this. I didn't know there was a website that did this. That's really cool. Like a website that kept track of everything since like season one. That's I pretty... didn't know season one. Either. Or not season one, but like that's that, whatever. I hope far down it goes. That's dope. Oh, uh, while while that was happening, Ninja Fish did uh, catch KJ with the up B on the ground, the level there. Oh, oh no. Bork. God, Zelda can't even up be out of Zelda can't even up be away from Sonic. Like on like horizontally. Sonic has enough speed to catch her afterward. That's so unfortunate. KJ takes another quick stock with um I think that was forward smash or back throw. I, I couldn't catch her. Yeah, he's gonna eat the toe. Even if it's not a sweet spot toe, he's gonna eat the toe after down throw. If he doesn't like the eye right. Oh, he's looking for an air dodge, yeah. but that he pushed out. I like the intent, but Sonic's just too low for that to be really be like a viable off. I mean, even if they hit him, then it's like, okay, farewell, Phantom. <laughs> just like, so, I, I like how the Phantom pauses, like he's frozen. He's like, oh my god. He's just stunned for a bit. Oh god, I'm he hit me. I'm quitting. <laughs> oh, nice try. Almost got him. And 20% for missing. Poor Zelda. It's a hard, it's a hard knock life, dude. Ooh, try two framing in with down smash, not gonna work. Uh, Almost got elevated again. At this point, he kind of has to. Oh, he kind of has to because there's so little that he can do otherwise. Oh no. Ooh. Automatically get up and uh, near his love. Just to... I feel like the kill power of down smash is also nerfed in this game. It kind of was a little bit, but not, not. it's not too much worse than it was in Brawl. It's just that in this, in this game, it's like. It's a little easier to recover. I feel like Afterward. it's also the kill oh, power. Oh, well. the, no. one, the one thing they didn't change though is giving her absolutely no horizontal momentum after you up me. Yeah, she just like falls in place. She just falls hopelessly in place. It feels bad, man. I feel another indirect nerve 